Today we'll be talking about Microsoft Windows 2008 server end of life. Firstly, let's talk about what end of life means. Microsoft operating systems are secure when they're launched, but over time vulnerabilities or points of weakness are discovered, and it's these that cybercriminals target. To stay ahead of the game, Microsoft spends billions to ensure everything is secure, and this is passed on to us as consumers through regular updates and patches. Generally, every 10 years, Microsoft will start again by releasing a whole new operating system with new and improved features and security. As of the 14th of January 2020, Windows 2008 Server reaches end of life meaning that Microsoft will no longer provide these security updates for the server. The server will still function, but you'll be vulnerable to cyber attacks. So this really only means one thing. At some point, you're going to need to upgrade your operating system. The next consideration is whether to upgrade the operating system of your physical server, or as we recommend, move your infrastructure to the cloud. For public cloud, we recommend Microsoft Azure. Microsoft Azure is Microsoft's cloud platform. It's huge, huge in scale and huge in scope and can seem daunting, especially as you're charged by the second. One of the major benefits of Azure is that with Azure Marketplace, you can deploy pre-built servers in minutes, so long as you know what you're doing. As a Microsoft Guard partner, we can help scope, build, test and deploy your virtual servers, as well as advise on the huge cost savings available, including Azure Reserved Instance and Hybrid Benefit. For private cloud, we recommend Teledata, which is a highly available cloud platform with a difference in the fact that it features site replication as standard. This means that should one data centre go down, the other will take over immediately with no loss of experience for your employees or your business. Now, if you're simply not ready to retire your Windows 2008 server yet, maybe because you're worried about the compatibility of an application with the upgrade, there is another option. The Microsoft Extended Support Programme allows you to migrate your Windows 2008 server into the Azure Cloud and receive an additional three years of server updates for free. This means that your 2008 server will continue to work as normal, be protected as normal, but will be operating from a virtual server in Azure rather than on a physical server in your office. So, in conclusion, by continuing to run an unpatched server, you will be open to attacks. By the 14th of January 2020, you will need to have done one of the following. Update your operating system, move your infrastructure to the cloud, or use the Microsoft Extended Support Programme. For further advice on your options, please drop us an email or give us a call. Thank you.